Is that what it is? Silkworm cocoons. Eat it, they're good. No, no, don't push it. She would have. No, 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 I would not have. Ladies and gentlemen, very briefly, you'd be surprised today at the number of people who like to wear silk, but who actually think that it grows like cotton does. I'm not kidding. Please note, cotton is from a plant. It's a cellulose. This is from an animal. It's a protein. Do you know what that is? That's a cocoon. That is a cocoon made by the silkworm. Have you all seen a silkworm before? Yes. Anybody that hasn't? Good. Try to visualize a caterpillar. That's what it resembles. Okay? Now, what happens is, is when a silkworm is about a month old, it starts to secrete a saliva, which in actual fact is a silk. With this secretion, it makes a cocoon around itself. And after spending about 12 days within the cocoon, it then pierces this and it comes out as a moth. <laughs> The moth lays the eggs, which then hatch back into silkworms. Ladies and gentlemen, it might be interesting for you to know at this stage that from an average cocoon like this, we can get a thread of silk which can be as long as 1,200 yards. Wow. Ten football fields, end to end, from one. I'm going to show you this now. It's a lot of caterpillar spit. That's what silk is, caterpillar spit. Yeah, ladies. One larvae per cocoon. Uh, one larvae per cocoon. How do we unravel the silk from this? We first have to catch the thread. How is that done? We put them into water. This is heated from the bottom to soften them up. And by using very sophisticated machinery like this. Okay. No, there's nothing there. Okay. Okay. No, no, nothing there. Very high tech. Okay. Watch what happens. Watch what happens. Watch what happens. She dabs the cocoons. And by doing so, you can see she has, in fact, caught the threads. Oh. Ah. Now she has a pleasant job of trying to untangle them. <gasps> Watch carefully. Watch carefully. Yeah. And... Oh, See the threads? Oh, yes. wow. Now, wow. let's watch her set this up and then I'll tell you what's going to happen. Oh. Let's watch her set it up. Please watch my hands. Can you see the thread sitting over my hand? Yes. 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 We get the silk filaments from an average of 25 to 30 cocoons, bring them together to obtain one thread, then spun onto the wheel. Oh. That wheel is going to rotate. Please watch my hand. Oh my. Can you see them running over my hand? Yes. And you can see them bobbing up and down. Yeah. They're the ones being unraveled. Oh, oh, now what is being come up? What is being spun onto the wheel is a oh, silk yeah. coming off the cocoon. And what that on the wheel is this. May I please ask you to touch that? Pass it around. When you touch it, you're in for a big disappointment. Ladies and gentlemen, I'm sure the ladies amongst us have heard of raw silk. Yes. yes. That's what that is. They make dresses out of it. That's what that is. Yep. Now comes the next question. How do we get that to become like the silk yes. that we know? Soft yes. and shiny. We put that skein back into water and we boil that in water with soap. S-O-A-P. After which, you can pass it over here. When we put this back into water and boil this in water with soap, this, ladies and gentlemen, what felt like horse hair, then becomes this. Please touch that and pass that around. Oh, wow. What a difference. Is there anybody amongst us familiar with chemistry? Yes. Oh, yeah. <laughs> are, you, are you a chemist? We're about chemists. Yeah. I better be careful with what I say. <laughs> <laughs> I failed that one. <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, what is it about the soap? The hydroxide or the alkaline within the soap removes the gum. It's the gum that keeps the cocoon in shape. When you remove the gum, then it becomes soft and shiny. And that amazing, there now amazing. is ready to be used in the making of a silk rug. That's how the silk is obtained. Amazing. Beautiful. Beautiful. Ladies and gentlemen, if it's okay with you, what I would now like to do is, without, you can pass it over here, without taking, <laughs> without taking up too much of your time, I'd like to give you some brief information on some of the completed rugs. Is that okay yes, with you? Yeah, yeah. Uh, shall we move along? Yes. yes. Please, follow me.